If you ask me my dream for identity, I'm gonna give a slightly selfish answer, but I think that's okay. I think the first thing that comes to mind is that my identity belongs to me. So far, what we have had is putting the organization or the company that's trying to sell me something first. Every consumer expects that we have easy access to all the personal data we're putting online. But we also expect the highest standards of security because it's my data. So I'm trusting companies with my photographs, photographs of my family, my children, my healthcare records, my finances. And I think the paradigm actually needs to shift where it needs to start with me as an individual or me as a consumer first, who wants that frictionless and super secure interaction and not ask me unnecessary questions. Don't ask me to opt out, rather I will opt in as and when I need. We've always considered there being this strong trade-off between security and privacy on one side and then convenience on the other side. The more secure we make something, then it has to be cumbersome. It's just not true, and it's not true with the technology we have today. So to make this a reality, bringing systems in like biometrics, where my fingerprint or my voice is the identifier, it's, it's more convenient and it's more secure. That's what we should be doing for the future of identity. Having that sort of experience would not just sort of reduce the friction for me, it would save me a lot of time. If it's my responsibility to sort of combat every single website and every single bad player out there, the onus is just too high for me. It just needs to become easier.